Hey there! This is just a quick little video. I just finished doing the other one, so I might as well do a third one, a second one, a third one for the channel. So, and you can see I have the mouse on, so this is a demonstration of how the mouse works. So, I thought I might as well actually build some sort of a house before deleting this world because I'd mined all this stuff, so I might as well make use of it. I'd really like to see them get these windows whoops did not want to do that get these windows to be clear glass although with the resource packs i wonder if they can be at least clear glass on how they work right now that would be nice because that's really kind of gross how it's all like icky here yeah anyway so this is just a little quick house thing that i made on that rock ledge so little spot for my stuffs. Not many, many stuffs, but anyway. And up here is a bedroom when in reality you'd probably want some curtains. And then a sunroof. So yeah, that's about it. And if this was a, like a real map that I was playing in, then I'd want to get some stairs here and have a way to get... Where's my boat? Where's my boat? Where is my boat? My boat? Where's my boat? There's no... Yeah. Okay, well, that's weird. I had it parked right here. No, oh, I'm going to uh, starve. It's weird that when PC version got the different boats from PE, they don't need a shovel to make it. Although, technically speaking, PE uses one shovel and turns it into two. I don't know how that works. And what's weird is in blue stacks, it would be kind of hard to do this, you know? But what I can do is on the wasp. I can hit D and A. If I hit them both at the same time, then it lets me go further out. So that's kind of interesting. And it does basically work. It's just kind of weird on how it works. So you can see I lit it up so I could have some more room to do stuff when I threw down some sugar cane. If this was on. Whoa. Can you. Are you going to stop? That was weird. So you can see there's some sugar cane, this is how I'd be indicating stuff if I didn't have the mouse on, but now I have the mouse on, so you can see it. And then that thing doesn't look too bad. I think it was a nice house. There's something weird going on when, if I'm holding it down on one of these buttons, I can't use another button. And I'd really like to figure out if I can, and now it doesn't want to stop again, figure out a way to make it enable the right click, although apparently the way Android handles right clicks is not the best, so yeah. Oh well. So just a nice little house on the hill. If a person was playing it more, I'd probably want to build like a tower over here, some sort of a lighthouse maybe. Expand this into it, that could work. Make like a multi ridge area going into a lighthouse. Oh, it's so weird. I have to hit left and right to go. But at least I can look around now. So, yeah. That's about all I was really wanting to show. And I'm still tempted to do some stuff. I need to test if I can do, like, a server-based thing. I know they have the... Let's just kind of go into the... They have realms. And it is free right now in the beta. But I don't think I'm going to run it. I'm not sure if they have like a separate server. That's kind of weird. 
And I would like to see... Uh, where is it? I'd like to see if people will start selling resource packs or skin packs. That would be interesting. I don't know if their terms allow it or what they'd try to even do to stop it. They have tried to stop the other people that are doing the pay for pay to win servers. So that's nice. Anyway, I think I've been rambling a little too much and this is just a quick little video. So we'll see you in the next one. Whatever that is, whenever that is. I'm not sure if I gotta do P E maybe maybe not. But anyway. It is interesting now because they have the stuff that I like, the redstone stuff. So yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.